I call upon those persons present. I call upon those persons present. To witness that I, Braden. To witness that I, Braden. Do take you, Brooke. Do take you, Brooke. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. In whatever circumstances. In whatever circumstances. Or experiences. Or experiences. Life may hold for us. Life may hold for us. I call upon those persons present. I call upon those persons present. To witness that I broke. To witness that I broke. Do take you, Brayden. Do take you, Brayden. To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. In whatever circumstances. In whatever circumstances. Or experiences. Or experiences. Life may hold for us. Life may hold for us. Right where we stand. I give you this ring. Brooke, I give you this ring. That you may wear it. That you may wear it. As a lasting reminder. As a lasting reminder. Of our marriage vows. Of our marriage vows. And as a symbol. And as a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. And commitment to you. And commitment to you. Brooke, would you repeat after me? I accept this ring. I accept this ring. As a symbol. As a symbol. Of your love and commitment. Of your love and commitment. Take my heart and take my hand. Braden, I give you this ring. Braden, I give you this ring. That you may wear it. That you may wear it. As a lasting reminder. As a lasting reminder. Of our marriage vows. Of our marriage vows. And as a symbol. And as a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. And commitment to you. And commitment to you. Take my heart and take my hand again and again. Right. For those who do know Braden, know that he's a stubborn guy, but in the best way possible. He knows who he is, what he wants, and he works tirelessly in order to achieve those things. Ever since meeting Brooke in high school, she was the only thing he wanted. All I ever heard about was this Brooke girl, and it was really starting to interrupt our late night gaming sessions. And from what I can remember, Brooke played hard to get. However, that never stopped Braden from chasing the only thing he wanted, and today he's finally able to call her his wife. So the stubbornness paid off. When Brooke moved to Medicine Hat for school, Brayden would drive four hours every weekend to see her. And then Brooke tried to move further by moving to Calgary. Uh, um, but Brayden packed his bags, a six pack of Mountain Dew, and he hit the road. He certainly is persistent. 
I have watched the two of you over the past nine years through the good times, the hard times, long distance, moving to Calgary and back, the pregnancy and delivery of Camden, building a house, raising a toddler, and through the many projects Braden has built. I know and have seen how much you have grown together to create such a beautiful life. I couldn't be happier to finally have watched you both say I do today. Barefoot on the cross well, Listening to our favorite song When you said you looked a mess I whispered underneath my breath Our greatest wish for you, Brooke, is that through the years your love for each other will deepen and grow. That your home will be filled with beautiful children, lots of family get-togethers, and laughter for all the days of your life. Take today and each day forward time to cherish each other. Never forget to put your love and your family first. I once read, you don't marry the person you can live with, you marry the person you can't live without. And this is exactly what we feel Brooke and Brayden have done. Brayden, on behalf of Tyler and I, mom and dad, it is my and Tyler's honor to officially welcome to you into the family years after we knew you were already part of it. To carry children of our 